Hey guys, this is Sean Sanders. Thank you so much for clicking on to my channel. So hit that like button, subscribe, and tell a friend about me. So I am back on camera and uh, I, this is long overdue. I'm going to do some unboxing uh, from Bonafide Bagatelle. I did some paparazzi shopping a while back. And I figured, let me go and unbox. And I'm only pulling my hair back because I believe I got some earrings. So I wanted to showcase those and not let my hair be in the way. So how is everyone doing? I'm doing great. It's a messy updo, but we're, we're not here for my hair. We're here for the jewelry. So um, just in case you didn't already know, you can check me out on my other social media platforms. You can hit me up on Twitter where I have been, uh, last week I was back on Twitter live tweeting with uh, Basketball Wives. I hope you liked the review. If you had not seen the review, uh, check it out. I think I have it titled as Monday Night, Monday Night Review, something like that. And so, um, and I have BBW for Basketball Wives. And so that was the premiere episode. So I did a review on that. I hope you enjoyed it. And thank you very much for the feedback, for um, the feedback. I believe Layla Lynn chimed in um, on me reviewing and uh, Black Strange Media. Thank you so much. And I also watched your review as well on Basketball Wives and I enjoyed it a lot. And so thank you so much for the feedback. I really, really appreciate it. Okay, so we're doing this unboxing. Now I bought this, uh, I bought this, ooh, it's hot today. I bought this, uh, the jewelry a while back and it's been sitting and traveling with me. So I just want to give you a, a recap. Now again, this is paparazzi jewelry and I got it from uh, Properly Bonafide or Properly Live, if you check her out on Facebook. It's also, also known as Cemented, and she has been really on her grind with um, her business, which is bonafidebagatelle.com, B-O-N-A-F-I-D-E-B-A-G-A-T-E-L-L-E. And so I, this is just a, an unboxing. I'm gonna unbox and I'm gonna do a little mini guy shopping. Now, Chelsea, I know you're gonna be watching this video. I am not trying to steal your concept. I'm just trying to do something to keep some content for my channel. So I am not stealing your concept. I'm just gonna be talking and un unboxing, okay? So uh, the only thing I really wanted to talk about was uh, this update with uh, Quad. And her and Dr. G from Married to Medicine, they are getting a divorce. And it's, that's sad. Okay, so here. So here's one of the things I got. And here's this beautiful ring. And the great thing about it is it's stretchy. And I have fat fingers. So you can put it on any finger. Isn't that nice? You can put that on any finger. And then one of the things I liked was I call this utility jewelry and utility jewelry is uh what i call is your go-to pieces it's probably things that you wear all the time it goes with everything and you can uh you can dress it up or dress it down i love that because it takes the thought out of what am i going to accessorize so you know if you if you are in my real life or if you see me on on um uh, on YouTube you'll see that I have utility jewelry I have my go-to pieces now here's another one I love this I'm sorry for the light because you really can't get the um, the real prettiness of it but it's a wrap around and you can wrap this around and I have a couple of pieces from other other companies uh, I've bought before and you can this is really really cute i know some people have also worn it as a choker i'm not a huge choker fan i do have them but uh this is really cute and you can get a lot of great wear and tear and it makes a real out a, a boring outfit a plain outfit it makes it pop so that's one and it's it's silver i'm a big silver girl i'm a big silver girl i'm sorry for the light Maybe I'll do this when next time when I do an unboxing, I'll do it when the sun is not so bright. And then, um, yeah, oh, so here's the one that I wanted to get that I saw 
Uh, this is a big statement piece for me uh, when I, because I'm not a big dresser, but I do like statement pieces. And this is really good when you're wearing this. This piece of jewelry is really good when you're having like a real, um, a, just a, a plain color uh, outfit. So if you have like a black turtleneck, here you go. Look at that. And then the necklace itself is really cute. So don't mind my swan. See, my swan is a utility piece. So can I, oh, I don't wanna do all that, but, but I will. I wanna do the piece of jewelry justice. So if you have, look at that. If you have a long turtleneck or one of those um, long dresses that just a, 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 just a solid color, like a black or, um, any any solid color dress and you want it to kind of stand out this is a really good piece to do and I like it because you have this here and then you have this here a teardrop and then you have these really cute matching earrings that are attached I really like that all right then I have oh these are blue post earrings I got these now these are called not all of them have the names, but it has girls will be girls. And I, I'm a Pisces, born in March, and my birthstone is aquamarine. So I liked these because I thought, oh, it's a good jewel uh, birthstone. Okay, so talking about uh, Quad and uh, Dr. G, it's really, really sad that they're divorcing. But are, is anyone really surprised? Let's put it this way. They're not... They fi she filed for divorce. Doesn't necessarily mean it's gonna happen because we all know how reality stars like to perpetrate. But, um, you know, I went to Maryland two weeks ago and was uh, talking about, uh, I was officiating a wedding and we were going over some things and, and she was asking me, the bride was asking me, you know, what would you consider foundation? And and um, I said, aww, thank you, thank you. So uh, I, I said that the formula, because I've been married for tw <clears throat> 24 years, and um, I said that there's, I would say there's three things that have boiled down for me that has worked in my relationship. One is friendship, because we were friends for, for many, many years, and I feel like for me, um, that has been a blessing for us that we were friends first friends for many years we, we, Romance wasn't even on the radar. We were just strictly friends um, And I think that that has enhanced our relationship because when you are going through your trials and tribulation um, The friendship sometimes many times is what pull, pulls you through uh, The other thing is uh, laughter <laughs> We have laughed you know, laugh so we didn't have to cry through some things. We have found humor in a, a lot of things. And the other thing, first and foremost, is respect. And I think it's important to have mutual respect for each other because when you have respect for each other, you are very mindful and very thoughtful with the words you choose to speak to the other person. And I say the opposite of respect is resentment and resentment is like a cancer and once that resentment gets into your relationship whether it's a, a friendship whether it's a, a romantic relationship uh, whether it's it's with your family any kind of resentment a person may have uh, it's like a cancer and what do we know about lots of cancers they mis metastasize and they creep into other things and um, it can be the end of a relationship. It takes a long time and a lot of communication um, to get past resentment. But when you're not communicating with your partner, that that breeds, that's one of the, the, the symptoms of a pending resentment in a relationship. So this one is called Sonoran Spiral Purple Earring. I thought these were really, really cute. Uh, look at that. Isn't that cute? I am really big into texture. And then you got the little purple. So I like that a lot. 
and then uh, I got some more this one is top class chic black urban bracelet it's just like the other one but it's a little bit more dynamic and I know that this is gonna be a wow piece I know it is so look at that isn't that gorgeous isn't that gorgeous you can wear this with anything I love it and then this one is called punk Prin princess white urban bracelet these are really really cute pieces and again you can look like a million bucks without spending a million bucks I can't tell you how many times people have want my jewelry and I don't spend a lot of money on jewelry I mean I do have some really nice pieces my husband has given me but a lot of the jewelry that I wear isn't a lot and this is why I think paparazzi is such a good product so oh I kept trying to get close enough okay there you go look at that isn't that cute all right so yeah I, it, it's unfortunate I'm sure we're gonna watch it play out and uh, see how that goes and again that's it's really unfortunate but you know you you have to keep those lines of communication open and you've got to respect each other's feelings you can't be dismissive you know even if you don't like what your partner is saying you've got to be you got to be open to what's going on you know and that's the thing you know when you respect someone you 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 do think before you speak and you do want to be you want to be honest about your own feelings but not at the expense of someone else's feelings and i think that's the whole thing about respect okay this one is called just in timeless gold post gold post all right oh okay these are just regular cute studded earrings every girl like they say you should have a little black dress every girl should have uh, some stud earrings this one is called oh I remember these oh I can't wait to wear these Queen of Queens oh that's nice you know cuz I'm from Queens New York okay that's cute that's cute Queen of Queens green earring now I saw these and I was like I gotta have these I gotta have these it's a jade look at that Look at that. All right. And then, ooh, money to blow. Well, I don't really have money to blow, but I, I like I like it. And these are brown earrings. Again, I'm really into texture, and I really like the detailing. Um, look at that. Isn't that, isn't that nice? All right. And then uh, the last piece, the, okay, this one is called Come Out and Slay. Silver necklace, this is my last piece. Now, I will say, uh, Bonafide Bagatelle has been doing an awesome job with the packaging, because like I said, this, this has traveled with me. I have made attempts to do my unboxing from at least well since april because i got i got this stuff let me see march 20th okay this is how long this has been going on okay so the come out and slay so this is a multiple piece see that very cute and then you have the earrings with it this is also another great utility piece i like that so I'm gonna put everything back in the box so yeah there you have it I thought I was gonna put the earrings on but you know that takes too long so um, yeah so uh, you know a, a little on a little known fact about me I did uh, send in an application uh, I would say two years ago to QVC uh, QVC were putting out a they were looking for QVC people to be the host and talk about the gyms and, and doing all that. And I really wanted that job. Um, I didn't get a call back, but I gave in my head shot and my resume and all that stuff. And um, it, 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 I, it wasn't gonna be in Indiana. I would actually have to relocate, but I was okay with that because I was like, I'll be bi-coastal for the right amount of money. 
I'll be by coastal for the right amount of money.